Hey, it's Mike coming back with you another video. Got some exciting things I wanted to show you. So I just want to do a real quick screen share with you and just show you exactly what I'm talking about. So here I am at my get response. I'm going to uh, just going to go ahead and log in here. Oops, wrong one. So I'm going to log into my get response account. And you can see here's what's come in today. So this is why I'm excited because uh, just check this out right here. Just this campaign alone right here. I've created 264 leads just today. And here we are just uh, almost lunchtime here on uh, Wednesday morning. This campaign here, I've created nine leads, two leads in this campaign here. So I want to show you that real quick because, you know, you can get these same kind of results by using these traffic sources that we have, these these trainings that we have. And that's what I wanted to talk to you about was this uh, internet traffic formula. And that's some of these techniques is where I'm getting some of these leads. So what, and, and really the most part of these leads is coming from that, uh, that formula, that, that training that's already been put up. And then, of course, we got the better training that's yet to come. But just the training that's already been done and put up in the back office of your Empower Network account is what's creating these leads. So uh, another question I've been getting is how do I use my Empower Network capture pages to get leads? So I want to answer that question real quick. I'll just log into my Empower Network account here. And we will just go in and I'll show you exactly where you can get. Uh... So go to your business, my business. Scroll down to promotional funnels. All right, so here's the capture pages and the system that you can use. So if you're using GetResponse, I'm going to walk you through exactly how to use this capture page. Now here's the funnel I'm using right now. So where I'm getting these leads and stuff, the funnel I'm using is this one right here. Let's open it up. I'll show it to you. Here's the capture page right here. Very simple, but very, very effective. This thing is converting over 40% right now for me. So this is a, a very effective way to get, uh, get leads into your system. So you'll go to, uh, let's just go back up here and do it again. Let's go to my business, scroll down to promotional funnels, to promotion funnels, all right, and then you can see your leads right here. You can click on that and see your leads that'll come into the system. Now, here's the powerful thing. Now, you can go ahead and use this page just as it is, and because it's linked to you, it's got your Ian uh, Empire Network username at the end of it, they're going to be your leads. They're coming into your Empire Network uh, funnel. You're going to have them right here, access to them. But let's take it one step farther, and let's not only do that, put them in this list here, but let's also go down here. And now if you've got AWeber, that's fine. Uh, I'm going to show you the Get Response. Let's go down here to this Internet Traffic Formula right here. Currently, it's the time I'm doing this video. It's the bottom one. All right, so here's your capture page that you're going to promote. Here's the thank you page. All right, so what we're going to do, I'm going to show you real quick how to take this capture page, go get a code from your Get Response account, put the code right here, submit it, and that way when these leads come in through that capture page, they're going to go to your Get Response account. So in other words, you're not only going to have the leads in this system, the system will do the follow-ups for you, but you're also collecting a list of your own that you can go in at any time you choose to in the Get Response account, and you can send a, you know, a simple letter to them. Hey, I appreciate you. Here's a free gift. Um, just was thinking about you. Want to get this gift to you? You know, something like that. So, let's grab this thank you page. So this thank you page right here. I'm going to hover my mouse over. And I'm going to right click. Copy link location. All right, now let's jump over here to our Get Response account. 
And what we're going to need to do is, is create a campaign. So you're going to go right here. And you're going to go down here and you're going to click on Create New Campaign. And we're going to call this one, uh, we'll just call it Test. <clears throat> Let's do this. Let's put EN Test. All right, so let's create. Oh, it has to be lowercase. So I forgot about that. E N test, and you got to have all of it together. So you can't put a space in there. So you've got to have it all run together. So E N test, create campaign. So apparently somebody's already got that. Um, all right, let's put my initials M P E N test. All right, so there we go. Um, sometimes you just got to get creative, use your initials or whatever. So your campaign was successfully set, uh, created. So you can add contacts. You can create a newsletter. You can edit campaign settings. You can create an autoresponder. Um, let's go ahead and create an autoresponder real quick. I'll just show you how to do this. So let's put... Uh, let's go ahead here. Okay, make sure you're on your right campaign because see if you got different campaigns like I do, you don't want to be on the wrong campaign. So we're going to have the message start day zero. So as soon as they opt in, they're going to get a message from us. It's going to be simp no, simple, no links. It's just going to be a thank you, appreciate you. That's it. Okay, so here is uh, our campaign. Make sure you're on the right campaign. You want the message to go immediately. Leave all these checked. They're going to be checked Monday through Sunday. Leave all that alone. And we're going to go ahead here and create new email. <clears throat> Excuse me. Message name. Um, let's put welcome. Subject. Thank you for taking the time to get ITF, Internet Traffic Formula. Let's put thank you <clears throat> up here instead of welcome. Okay, so then you just pick your emails like me. I've got several of them. Have it come from you so that people can start getting used to your name and see your email and your name. Build that relationship with them. I'm going to take a drink here real quick. Okay, so uh, you can leave all this set just like it is. Click Next. All right, so let's scroll down here and go to Start from Scratch right here. Pick this blank template, click it. All right, now right here, take this text block, hover your mouse over it, left click, drag it, right over here and let go. All right, so there we go. Highlight that, hit delete. Now let's just create a message. I'll put, hey, it's Mike. Just wanted to say hello. Oops, can't spell today. Thank you Okay, something kind of like that. So, just wanted to say hello and thank you for taking the time to check out ITF, Internet Traffic Formula. I appreciate you, and I'm here to help you.
however I can. So that's that's it, man. We don't want to put no links in there because they're going to get a follow-up message from Empire Network on our behalf. This it's going to it's going to send of course the video, and we don't want to uh, coincide with that. So we're just basically building a relationship and kind of getting our campaign set up here. So uh, pretty much leave it at that. If there is anything that I can do for you, please do not And I like to put three dots right after that. So I hit enter, dot, enter, dot, and that gives us some space there between because after your last uh, message, your last sentence of your message, you're going to have right below that, you're going to have the opt out and subscribe stuff from, uh, from your Get Response account. So it's always good to have a space in there. Those dots work good as a space. All right, so basically... Uh, that's pretty much it. So we're just going to go down here, hit next, and the bottom right corner, next step. Okay, now we're just going to, right down here, bottom right corner, hit save and publish. Okay, so there's your first message. So if you want to view it online, you just simply go right here where it says view online, and there it is. That's how they're going to see the message. That's how your subscribers will see your message. And then there's, if you want to edit it, you'd edit right here. If you wanted to uh, check the statistics, which they're not going to be any yet because we don't, we haven't set it out uh, yet. So if you want to duplicate it, you could do that right there. If you want to turn it off, you could turn it off right there. So that's it. Now let's go and let's create a web form. So let's go here to create new. Now remember, we got to make sure we're in the right campaign. So right here, make sure you're in the right campaign. So where it says MPE and test, that's the one we just created. All right, scroll down here. Leave this alone. Just simply hit this. That unchecks that. Hit this. Hit name. Hit privacy. Hit powered by. All right, there's your form. Hit next step. See, this is very, very simple. And we're waiting. It's doing something here. Let's go back to previous step. <clears throat> System kind of stalled out for some reason. All right, hit next step. Okay. All right, so confirmed is on, and we're going to want to change that. Um, let's change our web form name here to MPEN test. We want to keep everything the same. All right, so we're going to hit custom. Thank you, Paige. Take this out. Remember the uh, the link we had in our mouse? We copied. Let's paste it right here. Let's make sure the whole link is there, and it is. Okay. So this is our thank you page. Okay, put that right there. Hit next step. All right, now we're going to hit show HTML code. Okay, you're going to take this right here, these numbers right here. Right click, copy that. So that number right there where it says WF item, there's 
on mine anyway, there's seven numbers right there. You're going to copy those. Okay. You're going to go back over to your EN back office, your Empower Network back office. And right here, see, I'm not going to change mine because I've already got it in there. Uh, so in yours, there's not going to be anything. It'll be blank. So you're simply going to paste in your code right there. And you're going to hit Submit to Change. And it'll come up a message, say Complete. And then you're done and you're ready to start promoting this link right here. Now, not this one. This is the thank you page that we just set up in the autoresponder. So this one here is the one you're going to promote to send the traffic to. So that's pretty much it. Now let's run back over here to the uh, autoresponder and let's make this single opt-in. So let's go here to... Settings, profile. So you can set up a profile right here. You know, whatever you want to create. Campaign title, test. Okay, then you can go here to save agencies. You just pick one. Internet marketing. What I chose, you want to set up a description here and a picture, go right ahead. You can do all that. Permission, uncheck these boxes right here. This is how you're going to get single opt-in. So in other words, when somebody comes to your capture page, I know they recommend double opt-in, but if you want to get more leads on your list, and if we're going after targeted leads, then... We're not going to have to worry about, you know, a bunch of spammers, spammers, complainers, and all that. So um, you'll get more leads on your list. Now, if you do the double opt-in, which is fine, you'll get a lot better leads, but you're not going to have as big of a list. It's going to take a lot longer to build your list because people just, for whatever reason, they don't go back to their email and they don't check their email to confirm. So that's up to you there. This is what I do. Um, that's however you want to put it. So... Then here in this field name, you can change this field from. That's who the message is going to come from. And then uh, basically leave everything else alone. You're done. That's it. So that's uh, that's what I want to share with you. But you know what? You know, just look at this. There's no reason you can't be getting this same activity. I mean, here it is, uh, lunchtime. And I'm getting these kind of leads already. So by, the, by midnight tonight, before we start a new day, uh, I wouldn't doubt but what these numbers, matter of fact, I'm pretty positive that these numbers will be, I know this one will be almost double. And this one here um, will probably be, I would say triple of what it is right now. But I've got a lot more traffic going to this one. So that's what I wanted to share with you. I hope this video was helpful, and I'll see you in the next video. God bless. Bye-bye.